Hello there and welcome! In this video, we will show you how to lock time, plan and fill in your attendance. So as a project worker, you can create a tab like this to lock your time and plan attendance as we have it here. You can also lock time by going to more menu and here you have personal statement and here you can choose to lock time. I will open it in a new tab. And here in attendance management, you can access the attendance calendar. So this is how time logging looks like. Here you can choose the project, task, date, number of hours and type of the activity. And here we have a gauge diagram showing the percentage of work done out of the minimum 6 hours. So let's log 6 hours and we can see that now the percentage of worked hours is 100% and you can see the entry over here. You can also edit it. Here you have a list of projects you have recently logged time for which would make it easier for you to log time at the end of the day. Now let's have a look at the attendance calendar. Here you can add that you were in the office, for example on 11th of May. This is a big calendar of the whole month. On your dashboard you will have a smaller calendar just for the current week. You can also plan your attendance. So for example here I plan the vacation. You can do so by clicking on this green button. Here you can choose vacation or you can log a sick day and then just click create. Lastly, if you look at the legend over here, you can see that the green arrow means activity has started, red that it has ended, two arrows mean that the activity is for the day, and the arrows in a gray square indicate that this activity requires approval. So if I ask for a vacation and my boss rejects my request, those arrows will turn red. This was a quick overview of how to lock time and plan your attendance. That's it, thank you for watching and good luck!